right, it's Chris Combe here from Cinema Corps. Uh, I haven't done a video in a while, and you know, I just I got kind of tired of reviewing stuff. Doesn't mean I won't do any more, you know, reviews in the future. Well, today's kind of a review, just not a movie review. But um, I finally got got into this loot crate. Um, it's a monthly subscription for just a bundle of goodness but uh, I decided to do my first uh, loot crate review this is the May 2014 loot crate um, it's not huge but a uh, loot crate is twenty dollars a month um, there's some other ones like box of dread by dread central there's some more nerdy ones is nerd block uh, there's nerd block junior and then actually nerd block added horror block and I've got the first month of box of dread horror block and loot crate so I'll definitely be doing those and then based on what I think of them I might keep my subscription or cancel them but today we're going to do some loot crate so here we go cut this bad boy open hopefully you guys can't see it all right feel soft and we have a t-shirt Alright, let's see what this t-shirt is. It's a Zelda shirt with little sayings or little words, quotes on it. But that's pretty cool. I'm not a huge Zelda f I mean, I like Zelda. I played Zelda on the Nintendo but I might be uh, putting that in my booth when I go sell stuff uh, at the convention for 7 Play. Let's see, what's next? We have a bottle opener keychain. Let's see what this says. It is another Zelda themed keychain. It says, it's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Another quote from the original Zelda. Hopefully you can see that. It's a little... You can see my GoPro, what I'm filming on in the reflection. But, alright, that's kind of cool. What else do we got here? I feel something big and I'm not pulling that one out first so we have the friend zone soundtrack I'm not really sure what the friend zone is it says uh, watch Fridays 3 to 6 p.m. 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. I don't know what channel or anything Maybe you guys know. You can tell me what it is. CD soundtrack. I guess that's cool. I guess when I listen to it, I'll know if it's cool or not. Could be some crap. You never know. Alright. I have a Markiplier Tats. Loot Crate exclusive. It's got Loot Crate on the back. Skin should be clean. Remove clear protective top sheet. Press firmly onto skin. Well, I guess if you want whatever these things are on your skin. I'm not really sure what I'll do with that. Alright, we got some stickers. Captain Sparkles. Stickers. One says, take back the night, and one is obviously, 
I guess, doing the pose from A New Hope. The top one there. And there's the bottom one. Alright, let's see. I'm kind of underwhelmed so far because it's all Zelda and stuff that I don't really care about. And this doesn't change. <laughs> Looks like we got more stickers. Whoopee. I'm not really sure what I'll do with stickers. They'll probably just end up in a box and never be used ever. Alright, we got a oops. here's a button. They put a button in every loot crate, so I've seen. And this one is the adventure loot crate. So man, everything I got's reflective, so you can see my GoPro. Anyways, it's a Zelda sh uh, Link Shield says loot crate may 2014 adventure hopefully you can read that from that all right i only feel a couple more things left we have a minecraft hangers each pack contains contains one hanger looks like a little Thing that you put on your backpack or whatever. I'm not really sure. I don't really know if I'm going to open this. Since I don't really like Minecraft, I might actually sell this one too. So, sorry. But these are the ones that you could possibly get. can see that there's a zombie a pig a sheep Steve question mark and the last thing I believe come on please be the good thing so far I've been pretty disappointed and it's adventure time I knew there had to be something Adventure Time in this since it's the Adventure Time loot crate or the Adventure loot crate. And since I do like Adventure Time, I think I'm going to open this one up. Let's see what we got. It's a figure. It comes in a nice tin case. So I mean right there you got a tin case. to collect all right let's see what could we get what can we get we got all of the adventure time characters that you can collect so let's see which one we got uh, okay We got the blind bag and this one <laughs> feels pretty squishy oh no nope, it's bubble wrap and guess who I got the one and only Finn with the sword now that's pretty awesome I'm pretty happy about that one so whoa there goes his foot so at least there's something I kind of like in this package. But, I mean, just like other people I've heard, you know, it's just the fun of getting something in the mail that you don't really know what's in it. Um, let's, let me see if I can go back through all these items that I got in this remember this is twenty dollars a month so let's kinda see if we got our twenty dollars worth even if we didn't like everything so we got Finn in a case 
and I would probably guess that would go for about eight dollars maybe seven dollars who knows um, we got the hanger that's probably a good four dollars stickers freebies tattoos freebies the friend zone soundtrack might cost money but looks like a promo item we got the link keychain the Zelda keychain and I would probably guess that's a three dollar item and then we got the loot crate button another promotional item and then we got the Zelda t-shirt it's a really cool t-shirt if you're in the Zelda it's got I don't know if you you can tell kind of but it's got the words making out his body it's pretty sweet all right, so I would say I definitely got twenty dollars worth out of the merchandise. You got what six, seven dollars on the Adventure Time, four dollars on the Minecraft, probably three dollars on the keychain, and at least ten dollars on on the shirt. Ten dollars for shipping whatever site you would order something like that on but as for the money I think you got the got your money's worth if you like Zelda and Adventure Time and Minecraft as for me liking this eh, I mean I like the Adventure Time thing but that's not gonna take care of my twenty dollar investment so this one was kind of a dud for me I'd probably give the pack personally I would probably give it a two out of five um, but I mean other people who like all this all these characters games or whatever I mean this is a pretty good haul for 20 bucks um, but yep, that's my first subscription box review uh, this is for the Loot Crate, May 2014. And I will be back next time with either Box of Dread or Horror Block. I got both of those coming up soon. So I will see you on the next episode. And if you like these, or if you want to join Loot Crate, go ahead. I'm sure you can find it. You know what Google is. And I will see you on the next one.